what's up everybody i'm back it's your boy Ron good i'm back with another video for the good kicks channel the defiant couture a lot of people don't like the material of the shoe it creases up real easy i'm hearing a lot of different things but i got a pair in my size size 12. bam let's get into it jordan one defiant couture See what's going on. Good size 12. That's my size. Down there. Bam. Bam. Okay. okay. All right there. Air Jordan 1, Defiant Couture. This is like really my first time uh, seeing it. I didn't get the shoe the day it came out. It released. Um, one of my boys happened to be at the shoe store and they like, somebody either returned the pair or it was a pair that didn't get picked up. And uh, he called me, asked me, did I ever get them? Did you get them to find Couture's? I'm like, no, I lost. He's like, they got them up here in your size. Thought about it for a minute. And I'm like, bet I need those. Grab them for me. So my boy Lowe's, he is able to pick these up for me. For the retail price. He just so happened to be at the shoe store. Right off the bat, like the material on this shoe is different. The leather on the shoe is different. You no, know, most of the recent pairs have been having like tumble leather. You know what I'm saying? Like a, a softer le leather. This is like more so plastic. You know what I'm saying? So that, I definitely can understand how the shoe is creasing so easy. You know, I got this real plastic, like leather, so. Um, then like the, the color, the paint on the shoe. Somebody, in somebody video, they said this look like a, like a custom sneaker, you know what I'm saying? And that's what it, that's what it, the vibe it gives you, like a custom, you know what I'm saying? Cause it, you kind of can see the flaws in the paint. Um, yeah, like even up here, like you kind of can see the flaws in the shoe. So, with that being said, this definitely makes for a good shoe to have, like in the future, because it's a rare shoe already, and just the whole make of it, how it was built, you know. You know, imagine what we be saying about this shoe 10 years from now. Like, damn, boy, like, this shoe gonna be like, you know what I'm saying? Because it's, def it's definitely flawed. I see where the pain at, you know what I'm saying? So, so like, luxury. And you see the bottom on here. The bottom is not white. It's like tan or creamy, a creamy color. So it do put you in the mind of like a high-end shoe. You know what I'm saying? This is something that's real fashionable. Uh, it give off like a casual vibe, a casual. I might wear, when I rock it, I might do a casual. Like I might rock some khakis with it, but nice button-up shirt. So it gives off like a, a casual vibe. Um, shoe screen, Nike Air up top. Got leather up here too. So, what do I think about the shoe? I like the shoe. It's a shoe I want to hold on to. It's a shoe I want to keep. It's a shoe that's different. Um, I even like how awkward this is right here. Like, why does it stop like that? Like, it could have went on or like just been like smoother or stopped at the Nike sign. I don't know, but it's like awkward. It's like, it stands out. It's bold. Um, yeah, I like it. I rock with it. Uh, I'm going to wear these soon. I may end up wearing these tomorrow. I got a dinner to go to with my wife, so I'm going to do the whole casual look. These might be on my feet. And, uh, I might record some video on my cell phone of if they crease or how they crease and document that. Maybe post that on my channel. And, uh, 
keep y'all up to date to how I feel about them after I rock them and have them for a while. You know what I'm saying? That's the discussion we have on these. We will give updates on these. So if you got these, let me know. Now keep me up to date in the comments once you rock them. Do you feel differently about them? Um, if you didn't get them, do you wish you got them? Because I think they kind of, it was hard to get. You know what I'm saying? They're not in the stores no more, the stores that had them. So you're going to have to get them from a reseller. And do you plan on getting them? And also, these release for a little bit more than the regular retail Jordan 1 price. These were like 175 So they're a little bit more. But that still ain't bad. That's still less than 200 You know what I'm saying? All the other J's, 200 So Like your air on the bottom. the shoe out for you. I like that Nike Air on the tongue with that leather around it. It got like a more premium tumble leather right here, I think. So that's hard. They gave us a little hint of the tumble leather right there around the Nike Air. Show y'all the inside of the shoe. Show y'all the sole. So if you can see that, they should have put something right here, man. That would have been dope. Should have put something right there. That would have been hard. High end luxury car. Say that's what these are modeled off of. What luxury car would this be for you? Phantom. Benz. Maserati. Oh, G Wagon? It's a luxury truck. Still no on the foot reviews yet. It's coming, it's coming. Like I said, I'm gonna keep y'all up to date on the shoe and how I feel about it in the comments. Or maybe I'll post like little YouTube videos from my phone. And uh just keep y'all posted on these. We're gonna have a journey with these. Y'all keep me posted. Hit the subscribe button and hit that bell so you're notified. The next video, I don't know. I got some stuff coming. Stay tuned. Good looking. It's your boy Rome Good. I'll see y'all next time.